According to news reports, the Knicks are preparing to offer Tom Thibodeau a long-term extension this offseason, approaching $10 million annually to remain their head coach. Tibbs is entering into the final year of his contract. And here is Shams on the update. Let's hear from Shams here. Tom Thibodeau is one of the best coaches in the NBA, and he's going to be entering the final year of his contract next season. You're not going to let a coach like Tom Thibodeau go into a lame duck year. And so that's why I'm told both sides will discuss a new deal in the offseason. The Knicks very much want to lock in Tom Thibodeau long term. If he were to ever become a coaching free agent, there's not a short list of, of teams uh, that would try to go get Tom Thibodeau. He's at about $7 million per season right now on his current deal. And we see where these coaching contracts are going. And so it's, it wouldn't surprise anyone if his next deal approaches eight figures. You look at his four seasons, 175 and 143 in the regular season, three playoff berths, one conference semifinals appearance. He's already had another conference semifinals appearance. They're one win away from their first conference finals since 2000. Just what Tom Thibodeau has done in his four seasons in New York has been impressive. Uh, and I think to an extent, both teams here are playing with house money. But for either to make it to the conference finals would be just a massive, uh, I think, moment for the franchise uh, that, that gets that far. All right. And a good thing the clip cut off before Chandler Parsons had anything to say because no one cares what he has to say. Anything that comes out of his mouth is just straight nonsense. Guy went to the NBA and sat in street clothes for the entirety of his career. I mean, hey, he made it. Credit to him. But anything that he has to say is, is just invalid from, from the time he just opens his mouth. So anyway. There you have it. What do you guys think in the chat, man? What do you guys think? No brainer. Not a surprise. I expect this to happen. I expected this all year. I expected it even before, you know, even early in the season. Tibbs, Leon, Brunson, the whole squad, it's a family right there. They are locked in. That is the trio that is going to be running the show here. For the foreseeable future. Dolan's good with Leon right now. Leon's good with Tibbs. The team is good with Brunson. They're going to take care of him. That's your three-headed monster right there. How are we going to build a contender is with those three at the helm. Easy decision. The guy has more than earned it. What shall I say the record was? 175 and 140 something. Three out of four years you make the playoffs. One game away from the Eastern Conference Finals. Every single player on this team, past and present, for the most part, has had career seasons under Tom Thibodeau. Go back to players of old quickly. Go to Mitch, Brunson All-Star, Julius three-time All-Star, Isaiah Hartenstein's improvements, Josh Hart, Dante DiVincenzo, Deuce McBride. What I say about Quick? Quick was almost six-man of the year. Making the playoffs three out of four years. No brainer. No brainer. So I expect this to happen. And hey, whatever they pay him, they pay him. Dolan's got money. The 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 numbers not it doesn't matter. It has no effect on the salary cap. Tibbs earned it, man. Whatever the poll says, whatever the players have to say, hey, the players in the locker room are saying completely different. Whether you want to believe it or not, they're showing it by their play on the court. Tough, physical, no quit in this team. Whatever shortcomings are, they are. Every coach has them. But find me a better coach for this team. Right now, find me a better coach. Can't find him. So Tibbs is here. 